My name is Sierra Caldwell. Um, I am in charge of our internship program here at Premier and run all of our entry level recruiting as well. Um, I've been at Premier for three years. Absolutely love it. Love the mission, the people. Um, you know, we're transforming healthcare. That's what we're about. So we definitely feel that this program is valuable just due to the direct collaboration between the industry and teachers. We're always looking for that technology talent and we definitely feel like that comes and it's definitely grown through the teachers through the CMS program. Our internship program is going to be a 12 week long program here in Charlotte and at our remote offices. And we offer anywhere from development internships to IT support um, and to actually technical writing internships and to service desk. And this is actually real meaningful work for our students. So you're going to come here, you may know one or two technologies, and you will, I guarantee, leaving, uh, leave knowing at least four to five. <laughs> First and foremost, we are looking for problem solvers. We have a large mission to complete and we need people to really think outside the box and be very critical thinkers. Um, exposure to technologies, if you've done anything outside the classroom, playing GitHub, um, building your own websites, anything like that, we're looking for that entrepreneurial spirit as well. Um, and then strong communications, um, because if you don't have strong communication skills, that is not going to work around here. We're an agile environment. We love to communicate. We sit really close to each other and we actually program in two week sprints. So it's a fast paced environment and it's a lot of fun. So my name is Joy. I am going to be a rising senior at Clemson University studying industrial engineering. Um, and I'm originally from Augusta, Georgia. This summer I'm working as a corporate compliance intern. And what that looks like is working with different policies and trying to bring improvement to the corporation as a whole and make sure everyone is up to date on what they're doing. Hi, so my name is Maggie. I'll be a rising sophomore at MIT. And this summer I'm working with supply chain strategy as an operations analyst intern. And I, I was inspired to come to Premier because I really like the Charlotte area. I grew up here, I went to Providence High School, and slowly I'm getting into business because I've started to see that a business is really a bridge between bringing innovation to the public. Hi, I'm Matthew, I'm from Charleston, South Carolina, and I'm a rising senior at Clemson in industrial engineering. Um, I came to Premier uh, as a business analyst intern, which is a really cool opportunity to work with both the business side and the technical side. We work together to create these products that Premier uses to help promote change in healthcare. My high school background is actually really different. Um, I didn't, I didn't have any experience with business or coding at all, but I worked a lot with chemistry and I did some, I did some research. I was able to work in a lab in Duke for my, the summer after my junior year, um, just kind of working the project. And I think that really prepared me for the premier environment, even though it's very different because something that, something that's in, that you have the, that both experiences have in common is that you really you just get put into the environment and you learn. You have, it's it's very fast paced and you kind of you you don't really know where you're going, but it's just the journey that was really important. So during high school, I did the international baccalaureate program, um, and so with that, I don't know if you're familiar with it, but it it gets the students doing critical thinking and teamwork. Um, and I think a big thing here at Premier is teamwork and realizing like at school you know a lot of times you're pushed just to do individual projects and not collaborate but that's a huge thing here like we want to share ideas and bounce things off of each other um, so I think high school and critical thinking and projects um, really helped me. Yeah in high school I took a lot of math and science classes but aside from that I tried to you know create a fun environment for my classmates so I did a lot of self-starting projects like creating the ping pong club for my high school or uh, getting together and breaking a world record for the world's largest piggyback race. So it was just a lot of fun things that I thought united our school and just was a great opportunity for me to reach out and meet everyone. Something I would change, I would try to reach out to people. I would try to make connections early on. Um, don't be afraid to be a self-starter because that's going to take you so far in life. Um, you're going to meet everyone and just make connections. Don't be afraid to reach out. Going off what Matthew said, I would definitely reach out to professors or peers who are in fields that you're interested in. Um, they have a vast amount of knowledge um, if you're interested in that. Um, and it can definitely help you figure out what direction you want to take if that's something you're interested in. I say something else I think I would have done differently is just be more open-minded about trying new things. Like recently I started to see how important tech is in the industry and I think for me if I had tried coding earlier it might be something that I would just learn more as a career path.